rock thief boldly grabbed two fake boulders that used to decorate the outside of the Kelsey Theater, but no longer. And what he didn't know is that it was all caught on surveillance cameras. Take a look. The silver truck slows down around 10 p.m. Thursday night. Then the driver gets out, walks up to the rocks, turns one over, heaves it up, and takes it to his truck. And a minute later, comes back for the second one. The rocks were gone, and we thought somebody was pulling a prank on us, but uh, it ended up being for real. A.J. Brockman is an artist who developed the Lake Park Arts District. He owns Kelsey Theater and never dreamed anyone was lusting after his fake rocks. I feel like, you know, he maybe was in the landscaping industry or just looking to, to flip the rocks, I guess. If fencing rocks, they, uh, there's, a, I guess, an underground market for these. Apparently, they're pretty uh, uh, in demand. You can hide uh, speakers inside of them, and uh, they, uh, they're, they're valued at at over 500 bucks. Brockman sometimes uses the rocks as props in his theater, but usually they're just sitting outside. Once he realized they were gone, he posted the surveillance pictures on Facebook, where a lot of people made jokes about the guy who stole the rocks. The criminal hit rock bottom. That was another one that was good. So. Brockman made a police report and a detective is assigned to the case. So far, they haven't been able to track down the guy who AJ describes as mid-30s, bearded and wearing a Deion Sanders Dallas Cowboys jersey. Chalk it up to a learning experience. Just watch your rocks. And AJ says a nearby restaurant owner saw the suspect's video on Facebook and said, hey, that's the same guy my surveillance cameras caught stealing my fake plants and pots. If you know who this guy is, please call the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office. Terry Parker, WPBF 25 News.